Hey guys, my name is Dave. My name is Pink Fox. Yeah. Okay. And, well, today I'm going to be talking about something a bit interesting. So before, I'm pretty sure on this channel at some point before I talked about the fact that I hate dad jokes. They were pulled extremely obsessively yesterday. That, yeah, that. His dad, he was napping on the couch at his parents' place, and his dad came up there and was like, downstairs, and was like, Dave, Dave, Dave! Oh, the, the my God. Blah, blah, blah with the dad joke. I'm like, dude. Yeah, this, I remember, like, wasn't there a point beforehand where you were like, ah, oh, dad jokes aren't that bad? Then he comes up, and you're like, oh, never mind. Yeah. Actually, it wasn't my dad that did that, so. They're actually both of us... And then his us, mom did a, started in on him. If I remember correctly, the same thing. It wasn't my dad. My dad, uh, you know, like most dads, kind of overdo him. It's not exactly abnormal. I only have one in my index. Yeah, it's the Pomeranian one. No, it's a Labrador. La whatever. It's a dog. Anyway, um, the th I think the thing that really kind of killed dad jokes for me it was the same thing that killed or made you realize why I think they're bad at least your dad no <laughs> Undertale oh um, so for those who haven't played Undertale there is a can we play the game again you'll see me play it in a little bit yay there is a particular uh, <clears throat> character in the game named Sans oh I thought you were talking gonna say Papyrus no it's like he's he doesn't do dad annoyed. jokes Sans does a lot of dad jokes, specifically surrounding skeletons. What kind of killed jet dad jokes originally for me was the fact that he did it so frequently through the story, the main story, that I was like, I'm done. I'm done. If anybody ever says a dad joke, I'm just going to hate it. I mean, I hate the one that I've heard before, the Labradoodle joke. I hate that one. When you hear a... It's... Now, the reason we bring this up, I bring this up, isn't particularly that I want to talk about or vent about the fact that I don't, I don't like dad jokes, or she, I don't know what, how much you don't like them at this point, but... Your dad ruined them for me. No offense to him. Yeah. We love you. He jokingly does this kind of stuff a lot, and we do. We do love him. <laughs> but... It's... Not, this top, The topic of this video wasn't directly about dad jokes. It was more about the idea that when you constantly do something too much... It gets old and annoying yeah. and stupid. I think another good example of this would actually be the song Let It Go from the movie Frozen. Or the song September. Um, by I think it's by, like... I think the band is called Fire, Wind, and Air. Something like, like that. That's why I like the Demi Lovato version better. But yeah. Let It Go better because that one's it's not, not overplayed. overplayed. Yeah. Those two songs were very overplayed for an extremely long time. Now, depending on the song, was a different point in time. Um, but because of the fact that they were overplayed, people would look at it and go, Nope, uh-uh, we are not. We hate this, moving on, kind of thing. Also, that kind of gets annoying, too. <laughs> She's been doing that to me for, like, the past ten-ish minutes. So, there's that, too. Now, that I don't mind. I'm just going to hold my hand still to see if you can actually hold yours still. But I digress. Um, I don't know. Having the same repetitive thing happen over and over again, it's just kind of ruins things. And it's not a specific topic that happens to it, either. It's more like... Like, we've given examples of dad jokes and songs... Food actually would be another good example. Like, list something that you've had as a kid or as a teen or whatever that you used to eat excessively. Ramen noodles. Do you still like them? Somewhat. But not as much as you would probably if... It wasn't for the fact that they were made all the time. I made them all the time. Yeah, but think about it this way. If you didn't, you'd probably like them more now than if you did. That kind of thing. They're so good, just not as good to me anymore. It's a, like for me, this is a weird thing to say, or at least to a lot of people, it'll seem weird. I think it was like roast beef, I think. 
My mom used to make a specific type of meat a lot. Okay, you won. And <laughs> because of that, my mom, because my mom used to make this specific item a lot, and it wasn't just this, it was a couple different items, I would end up hating it. And to this day, I may or may not, I don't know, I don't mind it as I much. Really, I don't like any roast beef. So you don't the worry smell. about me making that. The smell. I can't eat it either. That's that'll that's a topic we'll save for another day though. Anyway, um it's just the fact that the repetition. Repetition gets old. And yes. these are good examples of it, in my opinion. In my mind, because it kind of gives off the idea of why repetition gets old. These are a few fair examples of quite a long list. Of songs, games, videos, yeah, dorkiness. I mean, if we're going off of videos, I was gonna say if we're going off of videos, the annoying orange. Oh, jeez, I hate that orange. He was annoying. There you go. Curious George. He did the same thing so often to the point where it was like, ugh. Okay, are we done? Curious George was a little bit annoying too. Yeah, but not for the same reason. But he was also an adorable monkey. Curious George isn't the same reason, though, and as Annoying. Annoying Orange literally did the same, hey, 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 kind of aspect. It's like, it's an annoying adulter version of a kid. Like, kids, hey, are we there yet? Are we there yet? No. Mommy, w Daddy, wake up. I want to go to the park. Let's 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 like go to that, the park. That kind of thing would be more adorable, but if it was like a teenager poking at you going, Hey, can we do this yet? Can we do this yet? That's when yeah, it's like... Yeah, let's go to the mall, Dad. 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 Let's go to the mall. <laughs> Case in point. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> that being said, yeah, repetitiveness can get utterly annoying. I think this video has made its point. Let's see, where are we on time? Yeah, this video has made it, kind of made its point on what is being talked about. Maybe in the future I'll go in a little bit more depth about it, but this one probably wants to spend a lot of time with me, so... Yeah! Gonna leave this video here. What are your guys' thoughts on, like... Uh, not Bye. yet, not uh, yet, not yet. Okay. As much as I'm sure you want to rush it, what are your guys' thoughts on repetitiveness? Uh, do you think it's annoying, or do you think it's normal? I don't know. What do you guys think? Let us know in the comments below. If you want to check out any other, you know, discussion rant type videos like this one, click the link that's near my head. Or if that's not floating your boat click quite the link there, near that's n click the link that's near my head. It'll take you right to his channel. Actually, that one will take you to any random video that YouTube decides that will match your fancy a little bit better. The channel link will actually be between us, or yeah, it'll be Or down us. below. No, I stopped doing that a while ago. Oh, you did? I have reasons. Okay. Anyway, thanks again for watching this video, guys, and we hope to see you in another. Bye! Bye for now.